I came to Operation Orange today because I didn't want to miss the opportunity to again see all of the med students here with all of the equipment, to hear from Dr. Shrum, to hear from Dr. Butler, and to really get an inside look at how a medical school operates, especially a med school in the field of osteopathic medicine. The medical students that I've met, they promote that atmosphere of a small town community where people know each other. They invest in the lives of other people and are not afraid to speak to them as another human being on an equal level, not speaking to someone as if they are beneath them. It doesn't matter where you grew up at, it doesn't matter how many students you graduated with, your family status, whether you're the first graduate, um, college graduate or not, um, you can become a physician um, as long as you're willing to and uh, have the dedication and the desire to and a good work ethic. Operation Orange has really opened my eyes to how much of a disparity there really is um, in rural communities, not only with practicing physicians, but in the exact same extent, the knowledge on how to pursue those type of careers. There's nobody to shadow, there's nobody to give outside career advice in that, in that way. Not being able to be a part of something like Operation Orange uh, and growing up and graduating from a small school, I had a lot of doubts whether I was able to uh, become a physician or not. Having someone tell you that you can at such a young age is, uh, would be life-changing to these students and to the communities that they grow up in. I don't remember ever hearing anything, having any opportunity while I was in high school to be exposed like the opportunity that Operation Orange is providing students to do. Which way I should go, where to go, what to do, how to do it. And Operation Orange answers every single one of those questions. Telling these students who grew up in small towns that they could do something great with their lives, that they could become a doctor, and being able to see that, see how the kids respond and react to it, has been very um, encouraging and very enlightening. I really love the program. I love what we're able to see and do. You know, being able to see a human brain and hold it, it, it really excites you. It ignites that passion to become a physician because you realize this is what I can do one day. This is what I'm going to be able to learn and this is how I will help other people with the knowledge that I can gain.